Welcome to Storytime Pals! Subscribe to keep the stories coming! Hi friends! It's your pal Amber here, and today we're going to read a really fun book called The Tooth Fairy Quits. Are you ready to read with me? Let's get started! According to Susie, spreading joy was the best part about being a tooth fairy, but tooth fairy money was boring. The tutu was scratchy. Tights were torture. Most of all, the teeth just grossed her out. Ugh. At the end of a long night, Susie dumped the teeth into the tooth chute. Any word on a new uniform? The fairies are busy, the manager Angela said. Please, this tutu is itchy and these tights are irritating, Susie squirmed. Sometimes you have to sacrifice comfort for fashion, Angela said. You're missing a tooth. Susie scrabbled through her sack and pulled out the stinkiest, stickiest tooth ever. She gagged. I quit! Susie slammed down her wand and flew home. <laughs> Do you think she really quit? <laughs> she can't quit. Who's going to be the tooth fairy? <laughs> Susie gathered fabric. Just wait. I'll look great without tights or a tutu, and I won't itch a bit. Days later, she looked at her creation in the mirror. Ugh, I'd rather wear the tutu. <laughs> Susie took a fly to think. When she bumped into Dax and Lily tending the garden, all her frustration bubbled out. I can help design, Lily said. Dax grinned. I'm a whiz at sewing. You aren't too busy, Susie asked. When a friend needs help, you help, Lily said. Dax nodded and the team flew to Susie's to get started. <laughs> Teamwork, that's awesome. Fabric and ideas flew around the room at long last. Teamwork made the dream work. Thank you, Susie beamed. You can always count on us. Come on, Dax, let's go collect teeth. Lily waved goodbye to Susie. Dressed to impress, but all alone, Susie missed the thing she loved most spreading joy, even if it involved gross teeth. I better go see Angela, she whispered. Check out my look, Susie spun around. Wow, Angela nodded. May I have my wand back, Susie begged, please. <laughs> look at that sign says not hiring. I hope they hire her back. Angela pointed to a sign, not hiring. Uh-oh. Tears prickled her eyes as Susie flew into the bathroom. She flew out into the middle of a fairy gathering. What's happening? Susie asked Dax. A child wished for a birthday fairy, Dax said. It's never happened before. No one knows what to do. I love birthdays. Susie said. The celebrations, the decorations, best of all, no teeth. <laughs> I'll do it, Susie shouted and zipped up to get the wish. A giggle came from the back. Oh, look, Susie has a fairy tale. On Susie's bum, toilet paper hung, flitting in the wind. Laughter erupted. Susie's cheeks turned watermelon pink. Susie stuttered, it, it, It's not part of the uniform. Clutching the wish, she flew home. Oh, poor Susie. Susie pulled out her toilet paper tail. How can I spread joy to be the best birthday fairy I can be? She crinkled the tooth fairy money. Susie focused, fidgeted. Creasing, folding, with mistakes and patience, eventually, exquisite! She popped the perfect origami bird into her bag. 
Susie put the memory of the toilet paper tail behind her and flew off into the night. At the birthday child's bedside, Susie reached into her bag and found nothing. Zip! Zilch! Her heart sank. I can't disappoint this child. How can I grant her birthday wish? She stomped her foot in the air, took a deep breath, and thought creatively. Susie snapped her fingers. I know just what to do. She searched the house, grabbed a roll of toilet paper, and flew off to spread some joy. Zip, zoom, criss, cross. Top to bottom, the room was a work of art. Escaping into the night sky, Susie wanted to grant a bazillion wishes. Zigging and zagging through the grass and up into the trees, her song flew off into the breeze. You've made your wish, I'm on my way. Zoom through the night for your birthday. Up and down in your room I'll sail, over and under till you're fairy tailed. <laughs> the end. Wasn't that a great book, you guys? So much fun. And Susie is super creative. That's awesome that she turned it all around with that toilet paper. The toilet paper that embarrassed her saved her day. Thanks for reading with me. Bye.